Long ago, two races ruled over Earth, humans and monsters. One day, war broke out between the two races. After a long battle, the humans were victorious. They sealed the monsters underground with a magic spell. Many years later, Mount Ebot. Legends say that those who climb the mountain never return. Hey guys, Cookie here, and welcome back to another video. And today we are going to be playing Undertale. If you guys want to afterwards, I could play a genocide run if you guys want to see that. But I prefer not to because I don't really like that run very much. So, anyway, let's get into it. So, let's click reset. Name the fallen human. Hmm. What shall we name this? Oh, I know the perfect name. Yes. This is going to be our name. Is this name correct? Yes. Bacon. Alright. Here we are with our beautiful yellow face and no emotion on a bed of golden flowers let's go howdy i'm flowey flowey the flower he 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 why'd you make me introduce myself it's rude to act like you don't know who i am it's because i reset Someone ought to teach you proper manners. I guess little old me will have to do. Ready? Here we go. See that heart? That is your soul, the very climax of your being. Your soul starts off weak, but you can grow stronger, but if you gain a lot of LV. What's LV stand for? Why love, of course. Also, uh, the soundtrack in this game is really good. I recommend you listen to it. But I cannot, like, find a way for you guys to hear the music. It's just like that. I just couldn't find a way. So, you guys are going to be with no music. Sorry. You want some love, don't you? Don't worry, I'll share some with you. God damn it. Down here, love is shared through little white friendliness pellets. Are you ready? Move around. Get as many as you can. Nope. Hey, buddy, you missed them. Let's try again, okay? Nope. Is this a joke? Are you brain dead? Run into the bullets. Nope. You know what's going on here, don't you? Yep, I do. You just wanted to see me suffer. Die. No, thank you. No, thank you. Yay! What a terrible creature, torturing such a poor, innocent youth. 
I love you, goat mom. Ah, do not be afraid, my child. I am Toriel, caretaker of the ruins. I pass through this place every day to see if anyone has fallen down. You are the first human to come here in a long time. Come, I will guide you through the catacombs. This way. Ah! I love her. I love this character so much. All right, let's see. The shadow of the ruins looms above, filling you with determination. HP fully restored. Save. Yay, I love this. Okay. Okay, hey guys, I am back. Sorry about that. It's actually the next day because um, my camera died and I had to charge it and it takes like a day to charge. Um, so yeah, sorry about that. Anyway, let's continue. Welcome to your new home, innocent one. Allow me to educate you t in the operation of the ruins. Ooh, okay. The ruins are full of puzzles. Ancient fusions between diversions and door keys. One must solve them to move from room to room. Please adjust yourself to the sight of them. Okay. All right. To make progress here, you will need to trigger several, several switches. Do not worry, I have labeled the ones that you need to flip. Sweet. Okay, I would like to point this out. Press D to read signs. You you read the sign by pressing Z, so you obviously know. So. Stay on the path. I wonder who put that there. Probably Toriel. Oh. So obviously labeled. Much labeling. Let's see, read. Please press the switch, Toriel. <laughs> I love that. I love how she has this all set up. Like, immediately. Splendid. I am proud of you, little one. Let us move to the next room. I love how she has this all set up so that if a human ever comes down here, they would know exact. she would know exactly what to say and what to do. I love that. Just has it all set up already. As a human living in the underground, monsters may attack you. You will need to be prepared for this situation. However, worry not. The process is simple. When you encounter a monster, you will enter a fight. While you are in a fight, strike up a friendly conversation. Stall for time, I will come to resolve the conflict. Practice talking to the dummy. Oh, damn. All right. Yeah. <sighs> Trying to debate on how to do this. There's one way to act and talk, which makes Toriel happy. And the other, which is to fight, which will be very interesting, I think. I'm going to do it that way. <laughs> Yep. I love this. Dummy looks like it's going to fall over. Dummy ch <laughs> I love that. I love that so much. Look at Toriel's face. I love that. I love that so much. <laughs> The next room awaits. Just totally avoids it. <laughs> uh, there is another puzzle in this room. I wonder if you can solve it. Oh yes, I can. Let's go, goat mom. All right. Let's let's compliment. You have nice um eyes. Yay! 
All right. I don't really know how to commentate on this. It's a hard game to commentate on. This is the puzzle, but here, take my hand for a moment. This is so cute. Uh, I feel bad for leaving her. Puzzles seem a bit too dangerous for now. Hmm. Yeah, no. I could do it. See? Simple. <laughs> you have done excellently thus far, my child. However, I have a difficult request to ask of you. I would like you to walk to the end of the room by yourself. Forgive me for this. Intense music. How you guys doing? Having a good day? I am. Finally. <laughs> Greetings, my child. Do not worry, I did not leave you. I was merely behind this pillow the whole time. Yeah, because where else would you be? You wouldn't leave this innocent child alone. Thank you for trusting me. I would trust you any day, goat mom. However, there was an important reason for this exercise. To test your independence. I must attend to some business and you must stay alone for a while. Please remain here. It's dangerous to explore by yourself. I have an idea. I will give you a cell phone. If you have a need for anything, just call. Be good, alright? Yes, mother. It's, um... You know what? Let's call her. Let's call her mom. Darling, this is Toriel. Huh? Did you just call me mom? Jeez, I said mom weird there. Well, I suppose. Would that make you happy? To call me mother? Well then, call me whatever you like. Yay. Alright, I want to see what happens if you... I know there's a way to flirt with her twice. Huh? Oh, he he. Ha ha ha. How adorable. I could just pinch your cheek. You can certainly find a better, find better than an old woman like me. Aww. Let's flirt again. Dialing. Oh dear, are you serious? And after you said you want to call me mother. <laughs> you are an interesting child. <laughs> All right. This is Toriel. You want to know more about me? Well, I am afraid there is not much to say. I am just a silly old lady who worries too much. Click. Say hello, darling. This is Toriel. You only wanted to say hello. Well then, hello. I hope that suffices. Hee <laughs> hee. Yay! Is there anything else? I could just say hello. Alright, let's go. God damn it, I didn't even walk two feet. Hello, this is Toriel. You have not left the room, have you? There is a few puzzles ahead that I have yet to explain. It would be dangerous to try to solve them yourself. Be good, alright? Yes, mother. I mean, goat mom. Sorry. Playfully crinkling through the leaves fills you with determination. HP fully restored. Save. Damn it. Whimsum. Spare you. Aha. Ribbit, ribbit. Excuse me, human. I have some advice for you about battling monsters. If you act a certain way or fight until you almost defeat them... They might not want to battle you anymore. 
If a monster does not want to bite you, please use some mercy, human. Ribbit. All right. It says take one. Take a piece of candy. Yes, you took a piece of candy. Yay. All right. Let's go. Oh no. Rugged. I'm gonna compliment you. Didn't understand, but was flattered anyway. Blushes deeply, ribbit. Yeah. Spare you. All right. Let's go here. I don't really know how to commentate on this. It's not a very um, good commentating game. Ring, hello, this is Toriel. For no reason in particular, which do you prefer? Cinnamon or butterscotch? Uh, usually in the other run, it would let you say what you actually like, but since I reset, because I accidentally, because of, um, I named my character Frisk, this happens, so. Wait, do not tell me. Is it cinnamon? Yes, I actually like cinnamon more than butterscotch because I never had butterscotch before. I have butterscotch candy, but I still prefer cinnamon. Hee hee hee, I had a feeling. When humans fall down here, strangely, I, I often feel like I already know them. Truthfully, when I first saw you, I felt like I was seeing an old friend for the first time. Strange, is it not? Well, thank you for your selection. Aww. God damn it, I didn't even walk two freaking feet. Hello, this is Toriel. You do not dislike butterscotch, do you? I know what your preference is, but would you turn up your nose if you found it on your plate? Right, right, I understand. Thank you for being patient, by the way. Click. All right, let's push the rock. God damn it. Spare you. I'll spare you. <laughs> Goat mom, I love you, but you're annoying sometimes. Hello. You do not have any allergies, do you? Huh? Why am I asking? No reason. No reason at all. Click. No reason at all. <laughs> all right. This puzzle. I always mess this up. Let's see. No! Ah! Always mess that up. Let's try that again. Hmm. So you go down. You know, it's fun at first with fights and everything, but it kind of gets annoying after a while. Yeah, so games, this fights get annoying after a while. All right, this is how you do it, right? Yes. Aha. Damn it. Push that. Meow. That's not what frogs make. Compliment. You have a um, nice face. Blushes deeply, ribbit. Then why are you attacking me if you. Nah. Alright. Let's see. Boop and. Whoa there, partner! Who said you could push me around? Hmm? You're at so you're asking me to move over? Okay, just for you, pumpkin. No, move. Hmm, so you want me to move some more? Alrighty, how's this? Hmm, that was the wrong direction? Okay, I think I got it. Watch. 
Just no. Hmm? You wanted me to stay there? You're giving me a real workout. Thank you. Finally. Oh, I want to talk to him. Aren't things easier when you just ask? Yes, they are. I don't want to freaking fight them. Aw, knowing the mouse might one day leave its hole and get the cheese. It fills you with determination. Yay. So cute. Listen. So cute. This cheese has been here for quite a long time. It's stuck to the table. Aw, poor mouse. <gasps> ah! This is my favorite character in the game. I love him. Zzz, zzz, zzz. Zzz, are they gone yet? Zzz. This ghost keeps saying Z out real loud repeatedly, pretending to sleep. Move it with force. If I say no, then it will exit me out and I can't continue, so I have to say yes. Sorry. I'll play music in this since you guys can't hear it, but I love this music. So, act, naps the book. Let's cheer you, naps the book. Hey. Come on. All right. Not feeling up to it right now, sorry. Oh, it's okay. Let's cheer. You want to show me something? Let me try. Oh, there's tears. I call it Dapper Book. Do you like it? I love it. Cheer. Oh, gee. I usually come to the ruins because there's nobody around. But today I met somebody nice. Oh, I'm rambling again. I'll get out of your way. <laughs> All right, I had trouble with this last time, but in the future there's gonna be a spider lady. So, the, actually, when you s buy something from her, it makes her battle easier. So, I had trouble with it last time that I had to get help, so, yeah. Leave 7G in the web? Yes. You didn't have enough gold. Monsters, monsters, come out and give me all your freaking gold. Some spiders crawled down you and gave you a donut. Ugh. Now we have zero G. Yay. I'm broke. But at least my life will be easier now. Now there are three frogs in this room. I want to show you guys a secret. Ribbit, ribbit, sigh. My friend never listens to me. Whenever I talk to them, they skip through my words by pressing X. That's right. Pressing X. Oh no, not you too. Hee hee hee. Ribbit, ribbit, I hear using F4 can... Yeah, yeah, yeah. He says, actually, there are four frogs in this room. The fourth frog... The fourth frog is somewhere here. Let's... Dinner. Eat your greens! Yay! Here is the fo fourth frog. In. He's in the wall. <laughs> God damn it, Doriel. Hello. I just realized that it's been a while since I've cleaned up. I was not expecting to have company so soon. There are probably a lot of things lying around here and there. You can pick them up, but do not carry more than you need. Someday you might 
see something that you really like, you will want to leave room in your pockets for that. Click. Also, I wanted to mention tutorial tutorial. Get it? He's in the tutorial of the game. And tutorial is her name. Tori. Tutorial. Tutorial. <laughs> I think it's right here. Somewhere right here. I know it. Right here? It's in the wall! I swear. Swing your arms and... Oh, I love this guy. He's so easy. Yeah! Dance would like to just don't care. Now where the heck do I find the freaking... There's an anti-sized frog in the crack in the wall. It waves to you! Ah! There it is! I found it! Ah! Alright. There's just one switch. <gasps> Let's go see Naps the Bluke first. Yes. I fell down a hole, now I can't get up. Go on without me. Wait, ghosts can fly, can't they? Oh well. Ah, I love him. Ooh, okay, locks. I'm going to not pick on you. Finally, someone gets it. Why are you attacking me if you get me? <sighs> All right. Let's go hit the switch and then we'll be on our way. Yeah. You know what? Next episode, I'm going to have a special guest. Ooh, this one's done for me already? That's kind of weird. Um, but yeah, wink. It's a switch. Press it. Yes. Hear a clicking sound. Um, but yeah, next episode I'm going to have a guest. Okay, let's dinner. Eat your greens. Frick! No! 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 no. Ah! Ah! One HP. I'm gonna die. Please let there be a save point soon. I swear if there isn't, I'm going to scream. Please, no one attack me. No one attack me. Flee. Don't slow me down. Hear a clicking sound. All right, where's the nearest save point? I think it's up, but I want to go right. Ribbit, ribbit, just between you and me. I saw Toriel come out of here just a little while ago. She was carrying some groceries. I didn't ask what they were for. We are all too intimidated to talk to her. Ribbit, that's sad. All right, you found a toy knife. Yeah, no. I'm not gonna have that. I don't, I don't want that. It's thrown away, yeah. But I think that's kind of pretty right there. If you saw that. Let's go up. Oh dear, that took longer than I thought it would. Yay! Ah, uh, how did you get here, my child? Are you hurt? Who did this to you? You get an, an apology. Aw, she's mad. I should not have left you alone for so long. It was irresponsible to try and surprise you like this. Er, well, I suppose I cannot hide it any longer. Come, small one. Ah, yay. Seeing such a cute, tidy house in the ruins gives you determination. Okay, I think I'm gonna leave this episode here. I hope you guys enjoyed. Leave a like if you did. And I'll see you guys in the next episode where we will be going inside of Toriel's house. Goodbye!